one or two well-scattered showers and perhaps a little bit sticky, but otherwise quite a pleasant time. Just That's the audition that won Jack Scott his job as a BBC weatherman 15 years ago. He's leaving today and things have changed a bit since 1968, haven't they, Jack? They have indeed. I, I'm, I'm glad the BBC gave that chap that job. Uh, <laughs> perhaps not on the strength of that particular audition, but nevertheless, I think perhaps my missus wrote them a letter or something like that, you know, Michael. <laughs> well, now that you're here, you might as well carry on with tonight's forecast. From all of us here, best of luck, Jack. Thank you very much. And tonight's forecast isn't quite as good as the one that I'd have liked to have given for my last one, but at least I can promise that southerly winds are now setting in, and southerly winds mean that the temperature everywhere is going to be that much higher tomorrow than it's been this last several days, several weeks, it seems. But at the same time, a depression here moving up the western side of the country, and that's really what's bringing these southerly winds in, is carrying fronts up that western side, and they in turn are carrying some rain up the western side of Britain. The satellite picture shows the massive cloud there, just out of the west of Ireland, uh, that's carrying that rain, the depression down here at this time, and all of that cloud is moving uh, northwards and at the same time edging a little bit further eastwards. So that during the course of tonight, I think uh, that although it hasn't happened yet, uh, all of this western side, southwest England, through Wales, Ireland, up to Northern Ireland by tomorrow morning, uh, you'll have some rain in those areas. In other parts of the country, it's just about dry now everywhere. It'll stay dry through the night. It'll be a misty night. It'll be a bit of a murky night, as I was saying on that uh, other piece there. Uh, temperatures that much higher than they've been recently. And tomorrow we'll find the benefit of those temperatures because 17 or 18 centigrade in the south here is the low to middle 60s uh, Fahrenheit and even in the north, 13 to 15 centigrades, the upper 50s Fahrenheit. So those temperatures are higher than we've seen for some time. And in central and eastern parts of England here, there'll be a little bit of sunshine to go with them. Few showers breaking out there eventually. And up the western side of the country, this rain turning showery, a little bit of brightness coming up there. But at the same time, through Scotland, you'll get some rain moving through during the course of the day and that turning showery as well. Well, that's your forecast, changeable after that, but as far as I'm concerned, all I can remain to say is to thank you very much for your wishes, uh, a very good night, good luck, and goodbye.